I feel like when you're on top of one mountain, you're really on the bottom of the next. I'm redefining, you know, myself and what my goals are, you know, for the next, you know, four to eight years. I think what I'm telling myself through change is that, yes, change is going to be scary. It's going to be so different. I don't know what lies ahead. I can't predict the future. From Tokyo came from such a high 2016, winning absolutely everything, every major marathon, all my events at, at Rio, and then being diagnosed with a blood clotting disorder. And then all of a sudden, you know, it's been a really hard climb up. So I think being more confident and still believing in myself that I can do it because I, I know that I can. I'm moving, new racing chair, new training. My goals are 30 major marathon wins total, and I want to be able to medal in every single event by Paris. So this is the year to re-event for 2022. Hey! Welcome again. Thank you. How are you? Good. Good to good see you. Good to see you. Yeah. Well, yeah, so here's the chair. Um, we got it pretty much done. Raise the knees up here. Good. So to me, I think you'll be sitting in the chair better. And training's going well? Going really well, yeah. When's it's your first race? Boston. So Boston, I'm working on being more confident in that first downhill. I feel like every competitor is much faster going down, so being more gutsy and reaching higher speeds and just kind of relaxing, because I'm a very good climber, but it's just that first three miles, I need to be more confident, and then I'll uh, be in the, in the game for the race. When athletes, you know, when they're in their careers, I think we're so focused on winning, 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 winning that we forget like our overall happiness, like where you want to live or what other outside things you like to do besides being an advocate for yourself and for your sport. And so that's kind of what I'm finding right now. But we're all very proud yes, of Yes, Emma, all the way to the end. With Illinois and being in Champaign, it's really, it's too cold for me and you're away from like the big city and having a lot more access to things and in sports. I mean, Florida is such a great place for sports, um, whatever it might be. So it's gonna be fun. I feel like my body's been wanting to go in this direction for quite a long time. So I've been kind of envisioning, you know, not only races that are winning, but kind of where I wanna be living and being happy. My phrase when I was younger was Yasama, which means I can do it. And so that's what I'm still, you know, instilled in me, focusing on being more and more confident as an athlete is there's new racers and the field's getting stronger and still being in the game as I was recovering. And so that's why reinvention is so important to stay on, on top of the game. Thank <laughs> you.